What's up guys, welcome to AB Auto and I've got some brilliant news for the channel and for the C43. So let's go. Okay, so if you follow my channel, then you'll know that I've been having some real issues this winter with crabbing in this car. Um, I'll leave a link in the description below for the original video, but basically uh, crabbing is tires freeze up in the winter um, and when you turn the wheel more than half lock to full lock uh, you get this horrible locking in the front and it makes this horrible crabbing noise and uh, it's just a really unpleasant and it's something that happens on all formatic Mercedes. Um, I know some people haven't experienced it there's been a bit of debate whether or not it's just on the right hand drive cars and it doesn't happen on the left hand drive cars. Um, I'm not 100% sure but um, I'm very sure that it happens on this car. And uh, we're gonna kick things off with this video now by showing you the issue. Um, and then I'm gonna show you the same scenario where it is now, I'm happy to say, 100% fixed. And I'm gonna tell you guys how I fixed it. Right, so here's the clip um, I posted last week, um, pulling out of my driveway um, when I had the crab in at a really bad time. Uh, freezing conditions, as you'd expect uh, this time of the year. Um, not very pleasant at all. Check this out. Okay, so as you saw in that video, not good. Really, really loud, uh, it's affecting the handling a bit as well. Not pleasant at all. But as I suspected all along, I've been saying this since I reported this issue initially on my five things I hate about this car. Um, I love the car, by the way, if you're new to the channel. I had lots of great content on this car. But I always thought that it was due to the run flat tires, the factory fitted tires to this car. Run flat tires are not really liked at all online. Um, they've got a lot of bad rep and it's because they're quite stiff, um, they freeze up, um, they're not as good ride quality and really you probably don't want to run on your tires anyway when they're flat so I don't really see a purpose for them with me but um, well they come on the car and Mercedes seems to think they're the ones to use. So how did I fix this crabbing issue? Well, as you probably suspected, we got rid of the run flat tires and now we're running on Michelin Pilot Sport 4s. And this is what it sounds like pulling out of my driveway. I just shot this clip this morning in freezing conditions, similar conditions to before, and you will see and hear there is no crabbing at all. There you go guys, what do you think about that? That's so much better. Here's just a little bit more of me driving that morning. Okay, so driving with the new tires, uh, as you probably saw earlier, the crabbing is completely gone from pulling out of the driveway. Let's see how we get on coming out of my tight little estate here. Now this corner here, I always used to get crabbing on in the morning because you have to do quite a tight turn. So let's see how it fares. Almost full lock here, nothing at all. It feels so much smoother and nicer. See, now I always thought with the crabbing it was the full lock um, that really caused the most, but now that I'm driving around here without, with the crabbing completely eliminated, I can feel that just the little turns at slow speeds does make, does make a difference. Like this turning, for example, I'm taking it full lock now and I'm going around nicely, whereas normally I would compensate for the crabbing and I would do less of a turn and I'd end up in the middle of the road when I got around the corner. And I just feel that naturally I'm not doing that now. I'm going to give these tyres a real full test, but I must say guys, first impressions, they are unbelievably good. Um, I went on a trip on the weekend, um, been driving the car around all weekend, um, 
they're softer than the run flats that's for sure so they're actually more comfortable and i think there's less wind noise which means more amg performance exhaust noise which is always a good thing so yeah the ride quality has definitely improved i mean we're in comfort mode right now we're on a very bumpy british road um very neglected road i might add um and it's just soaking up the bumps a little better a bit, little bit better i believe um the run flats are very stiff and hard and obviously we've got a lot more grip now i mean they're new tires so they're going to be very grippy but um i've got real high hopes about these tires i'm looking forward to properly testing them and making a review video just another quick test guys just to confirm the cravin is fully gone we're going to do a full circuit here like we did in the other video with the window down we're going to go full lock 100 percent full lock now no noise at all it is buttery smooth And there we have it, that is a buttery smooth full circle round. Okay, so there you have it guys. That is the crabbing issue completely gone. I'm so pleased because it was so annoying. Uh, I know that tons of my viewers were commenting in my previous video saying they have the exact same issue. So I'm really happy that I've managed to uh, test this and fix it. So I highly, highly recommend to anyone suffering this issue, whether or not you saw my previous video or you're a new visitor to the channel, get rid of the run flat tires, get yourself some high quality tires like the Michelin's, um, they're Michelin Pilot Sports. I didn't get the Michelin Pilot Sport S, I got the Michelin Pilot Sports. Um, there's a very good reason why I didn't get the S and I got the regular, and I'm gonna be covering that in my full review of the tires on this car. Uh, we're gonna be looking at handling, we're gonna be looking at wet conditions, we're gonna be looking at braking. We're basically gonna run the tires through their paces in a very high performance car, this C43 AMG. And um, I think they're the best tires for this car. Um, we're gonna find out. So that's a video coming to look forward to. Um, of course, guys, if you like this video and you found it helpful, please hit that thumbs up button because it always helps me and the channel out. And um, for more content on this car and general Mercedes bits, uh, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time.